here we are recording this from Miami, Florida in our office and you know I, I'm thinking like we as a company we don't ask for a lot you know we should ask you to you know just just work and um, the money is here the potential is here I gave I don't even know like I want to like I just want to be just like blurt it out like how much in how much in checks we've given out just this week alone but I don't know if you know if anybody wants me to share that information but that that that's so we're dealing with here um you know you can make six figures a month really I know people doing that yeah anyways what I was what I was saying is okay yeah so what but I just got something right here um I'm a very appreciative somebody gave me uh a booster shot so <laughs> Let me try it out. I'm calling to see if there's still a No, it was very fruity. Um, yeah, I don't know. Health shot, I feel healthy already. Yeah! yeah! Yes! <laughs> Fuck yeah. Just fun and like literally as as we were as I was in battle. As we were just finishing up the, the health shot thing, I just saw this, which is, uh, we just funded a 40k deal in the books. Auto repair shop in Michigan. You know, I, I like, I like doing, I like auto repair shops because I've used them quite a bit back in the days when I used to crash my car a lot. So I, I like doing business with auto repair guys. I even went to, I even went to one, a merchant. I found out this merchant's auto repair in Staten Island. I took my car there to get it fixed. So it's it's cool. It's just a small world and small world in this industry, really. What we do, but yeah. It's the the feeling is fucking awesome. That's gonna be real good when it comes in. But also, uh, we 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 uh, low key owe, owe this funder money on on on, a, on another deal that went bad. Like the merchant stopped paying, so you know we lost a little bit of money there. Like sometimes if the if a deal goes bad and the merchant defaults within the first thirty days, a lot of times we have to give the commission back that we that we get on that deal. Just so you know, quick quick pro tip. <laughs> But yeah, and then, um, when instead of paying it back, like sometimes we'll just be like, yo, just roll it over on the next deal, pay you back on the next one. That's what we did here. That's uh, that's huge. It's very, very big victory. He's paying me off and I'm giving him additional money. I had money in that deal too. So like, you know, syndications. And he signed my PSF. So I, it's just, it's just, like, it's just real good, real good. Real, 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 real nice person, real gentleman. Okay, so a syndication is, let's say, let's have a pool of money, right? We're giving this merchant 40K, let's just say, 50K. A syndication is you're buying a percentage of that of the participation in that deal. So let's say I'm putting up, I'm gonna put 10 grand of my own money to this deal, and then he's gonna be making, I'm gonna get some of that payments. I'm gonna get 20% of whatever the funder gets is gonna come to me instead. So it's like, you know, you're, you're buying participation in the deal, basically. That percentage automatically, whatever, 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 whatever anytime this guy clears a payment a percentage of that will go to me instead based on based on how much i bought into the deal for and in this this one basically i had i had money in this guy's deal and then he's paying me off so now i get the rest you know instead of, instead of waiting six months to get paid from this deal i'm getting it now because he's paying me off so i'm, I'm glad that we're back on track funding deals he bought somebody in he told me no i called him like six times i do not care i have no feelings i have no i have no shame tree like they say in jamaica i really don't have a shame tree i pee in public i have no shame tree what i want to say is it's old. and another thing he's sending his brother over too so i'm gonna fund his brother this guy told me no like three four times he was just being stubborn this is the part of the morning where we're lining up the deals that are probably gonna fund early in the early in the morning or uh, in the afternoon um, as well as set up deals for Monday because Fridays is those kind of days where you know um, someone once told me don't send me out contracts on Fridays because then the merchant has the entire weekend to think about it <laughs> but uh, we send contracts out on Fridays uh, good to have everything on camera yeah. you, know, he's, you use it in court or Camera never lies. As much as I like people and I love them, no trust. People have sticky hands. Uh, I would be mad if someone went in my jar. And it's on my desk. Plus, we're uh, documenting the Ooh. creation of the best and biggest MCA company. Funding. Funding America. This is like weird. Like, you can have your own camera system. Like, and watch it from your phone. Thank you, Jim. What we just did, we, we took 
we heard about a situation that was happening with a couple of our merchants. They took control of the situation. That was me taking control and figuring out what's going on. I'm gonna call it back again. Like there was a merchant that was not filling in contracts correctly. So we need to make sure that the deal is legit and not, not fraud. They, the underwriting thinks the deal is fraud right now and, and I'm trying to tell them it's not. And this deal is, uh, I wanna make sure that deal gets done today because we've just been waiting like super long. It's been like a week. I've been waiting on the deal, that deal for like a week. So, so I'm gonna make sure that we're on top of it. And you know, one thing that is important in this industry, we talk about, say it's meta is speed right so that we're you know there's a lot of communication that goes on between us and underwriting and so we want to make sure that underwriting or the funder tells us to get something we get it asap from the merchant and then once we get it we gotta get it to underwriting asap so it's like you know you're trying to get the ball out of your hands asap quickly you know and it's the game that we that we, that we play here I love what I do. I just like persistence for myself and whatever I'm representing. That's what I stand for. Because me showing how much I care is by my performance. I've never been the type, no matter where I work or the people I know, I've never kissed anyone's ass to get in my way or anything I need. I just work a hundred times or ten times more than the person that's number one in the room so I can meet that accountability. That's just my thought process. Um, with that said, What's up, YouTube? Here, Sean is talking about a deal that we worked all day on. It got killed in final underwriting. We had to revise the entire offer. We couldn't give you the name of the business name, so just want to give you context of what's going on here. Well, it's funny, you know what I'm saying? I told him to come back to me. In the next 30 business days, we're able to get that deal out. The deal got in today, I offered him, you know. Told me no like six times. Nope, have a good day. Nope, have a good day. Nope, have a good day. Call him this morning. I was on the phone with him for about like, I want to say 45 minutes. So you imagine my home, 45 minutes of my day went to the deal. But you know, that's what it takes. I, like I told him on the phone, I'm treating him like a million dollar deal. Whether you're a 5K, 3K, we'll get it done. You guys are willing and capable and have a need for the money. We'll get it done. We'll, got, we'll put you guys in something that makes sense. I tell a guy, we're never going to put you guys in a, in a situation or put ourselves in a situation where we put you in something that will over leverage you. That's not the point here. That's why we underwrite so they can see what you guys can handle. Pretty excited. Funding America. Another one, you know. That's why I, I just, I, that's my dream. Just to fund every day. At least two, one, three, four, you know, eight deals a day. You know, that would be, that would be, <laughs> that would be nice. But we're going to get there. And, um, you know, like Dave always says. There's better days to come. So I just try to like stay focused and keep my passion, just keep going. You know, that's all we got here is to keep going. And one thing someone told me once that I always remember and always go by now is um, we only have now. So we have to live in the now. 